Hi, um, it's Claire Nielsen again. Just want to give you a bit of an update as to what's going on. Um, these are certainly interesting times. Um, I've got to admit, I didn't expect um, to be in a place where there's bushfires, um, and there most definitely are. Um, I'm uh, the, where I'm staying. I've just moved uh, locations, uh, but just to the other side of Mullumbimby. But the um, the bushfires here are um, uh, 14 uh, kilometres away from, uh, from where I'm staying now, um, and uh, they are out of control. So I went to a meeting today, and uh, they were kind of discussing. Uh, evacuation procedures for people who are living in the most vulnerable areas. So the people where I'm, I'm now staying aren't, aren't concerned about that. Obviously, we're in the town here, but you you get a, a gist. It, it is it is quite significantly. Um, uh, it, well, it's it's not been as bad as this since the 1960s. Uh, so this is unprecedented in this area. So um, so this is very much uh, part of <laughs> what we face. Um, last night uh, I had the Great privilege of, of working with um, some of the guys that um, I know uh, spiritually, and we were uh, we've been given a mandate to um, to contend uh, in the spirit, and um, and so we you know believe in that's going to make a significant uh, impact. Uh, but tomorrow is the day that they're expecting uh, that to be uh, to be the worst day. And uh, so that's why around here quite a few people have already evacuated. And um, uh, yeah, so we will see how that plays out. But, you know, uh, our God is a faithful God and uh, he wouldn't have given us a mandate to do that if he, if he wasn't going to um, come through. So I will keep you posted. Um, but uh, yeah, interesting times. Speak to you soon.